Hey, how's it going everybody? Today we have Batman the Brave and the Bold, a set of eight different cool looking toys released by McDonald's back in 2010. Let's get them opened up and have a little fun. Number one in the set is Batman. Check it out, he's got the old school look going on. I like the blue, I like the bat symbol on his chest, all looking like old school stuff. You can move his arm up and down and that's it for articulation. It's just a solid four inch molded piece of plastic. But you know what, he looks great. And his gimmick is he's got this little lever back here. You can move his arm up and down. And what's really cool is he comes with these three little batarangs made of paper and you can store them right here on the back. Let me show you how to put one of these in there. What you do is you just place it in just like so and then push it into the top and you can store all three in the back just like that. And what's really cool is you take the batarang and you place it in his hand just like so. It's a little tricky because my hands are just so big. Put it in there just like so, rest it in there. And then what you do is you pull the lever back here, pull it down and it's spring loaded and you let it go. <laughs> and that's it, he doesn't throw it very far. But it's awesome. Number, number two is the Joker, Batman's arch enemy. Look at this guy. He looks so cool. Look at that face. He's so mean and scary looking. So he's got two points of articulation. One, you can spin his arm all the way around and his head, you can wiggle it back and forth. And he stands about four inches tall, about the same height as Batman. What's really cool about this guy is he's a water squirter. On the back here, you can see this button. You push it in and out and it pumps the water in and out. So what you would do is you take your cup of water, hold the Joker underneath, and pump the water in just by pushing the button and then pull it out and then start squirting everybody with it. And then the hole right there on this little little flower right there, you just start squirting it. Very cool. Number, number three is Aquaman. Who doesn't like Aquaman? I think Aquaman is awesome. Look at this guy. Very cool looking toy. He's got one point of articulation. You can spin his head all the way around if you'd like. And on the back here is a lever gimmick and it's spring loaded. And what you do is he comes with this little ball of clear plastic which is actually supposed to simulate water. So he's holding a ball of water. And what you do is you pull the lever down just like so. You place it in his hands above his head. Oops, just like that. <laughs> and then what you do is you hold it down just like so and then let it go. And then he throws the ball of water. That's just so cool. Next up at number four is Plastic Man. Check this guy out. He looks so wild. Look at this. It's all strung out and weird looking, but he's really cool at the same time because he's got a lot of posability. You can rotate his head back and forth. You can rotate his arms all the way around. And what's really neat is that all four limbs are made of soft plastic, almost like a rubber. And inside there's a metal wire in there. So you can pose these all over the place. You can take this giant hammer hand, pose it like this here. And he's got this giant fist. Look at this thing. How wacky is that? That's just awesome. You can pose it up here like this, make him do splits. <laughs> I absolutely love this guy. And next up at number five is the Batmobile. Now this is awesome. Check out that big red fin on the back there. Now, now this is actually just a casing for the inner vehicle. So you pop this apart, check this out. Inside here, there's a little Batmobile thing going on here. Now I was checking this out. I'm not really sure what you call this particular vehicle. If anybody knows, let me know down below. And also, what kind of suit is Batman wearing? It looks awesome. This thing is just really neat. So it has a little pullback feature, just three wheels underneath here. What you do is you put this in here, pop it together, just like so. Once you get it together, you pull it back and then little Batman vehicle comes sh shooting out of there. Let's check it out. Let's see if we can get this to work. Oh, kind of story. Well, <laughs> you get the idea. But this is just a fantastic little toy with tons of playability. Up next at number six is the Black Manta Sub Launcher. This looks really neat. Look at this thing. Awesome, right? So he has this piece here and he has this little, I guess what you would call a turret, like three little legs here. You can actually move and pose these all over the place. And you take the sub part here and you peg it onto the top and place this on here just like so. And it comes with a, a rocket here. What you do is you place it in here just like so and it's spring loaded. And then you can pose these however you want. You can lay it down like so. You can move it up just like this here. You can pose these legs all kinds of different ways. And then on the side here, you can see this little yellow button. You push that and it launches the rocket. Check it out. Oh man, I love firing stuff. Next up at number seven is the green arrow. Check this guy out. Who doesn't like the green arrow? This guy's awesome. So he has one point of articulation. You can rotate the head all the way around if you'd like. And he has a gimmick here where you fire two different missiles. You have this missile, which is actually kind of cool. It has a little boxing glove fist on the end. And then you have a traditional arrow here with just a regular arrowhead there. And what you do is just slide them in to the bow here, if you will, and it's spring loaded, just like that. It fits right in. Then you push his arm back to the, just push it to the left a little bit and it launches the arrow. Check it out. Wow, that's pretty cool. Then you slide this one in just like so. Get a slit in there, locks it into place, pull the arm and there you go. 
Oh yeah. And last up at number eight is the Blue Beetle. Check this guy out. So he's got two points of articulation. You can rotate the arms all the way around just like so. And he's got two clear blue wings, which actually come separated. And you have to apply them to the back here just by simply snapping them onto the back, just like this here. And then that's it. And then what you do here, he's got the one loose leg and what you do is you wiggle this back and forth and it flaps his wings. Check it out. <laughs> now that is awesome. So there you have it everybody, Batman the Brave and the Bold, set of eight different awesome toys released by McDonald's back in 2010. I absolutely recommend this set. There's so much playability here and any collector of the DC Universe is absolutely going to want this set. Thanks for watching everybody. Take care. We'll see you next time.